This is Inelia Benz for Ascension101.com and we're on day 14 of our experiment in consciousness to intend to be and exist as joy like love for one hour a day for 21 days. And today has been really quiet but within that quietness I found it to be uh, that the resistance is still there, resistance from the collective and the fear from the collective to allow that possibility, that reality of existing in as our core selves rather than all the programs. And it's interesting to see that the where, where the fears are coming from uh, one of the most interesting is the it's not going to work kind of thing. Um, another one is it's going to be boring, and the other is like uh, when I when I drill down into those energies and other type similar type resistance kind of explanations, I find that it's mostly a fear of change, and that's it. That's it. That is just fear of change. So, fear of change, you're welcome here. <laughs> and that's perfectly fine, you know? And you can exist. It's funny because us as human beings learn from others, learn from watching and observing. We copy. And as more and more individuals around the planet begin their experiment in consciousness, the more and more individuals around them become aware of it and become exposed to that energy or to that person, you know, saying, what the hell, I'm going to try it anyway, you know, I'm going to do this and see what happens. And the changes I found the first few days were really amazingly huge. You could really tell the difference. Now I'm finding that apart from that energy of resistance, the existing as joy like love is beginning to be the norm, like the, the, the part what, that's normal and everyday, and everything else seems to be like a dissonance to that. So easily identifiable and easily looked at and processed or acted upon, responded to, but no longer reacted to, yeah? <laughs> so, yeah, it's, it's good. The energy's good. I like, I like what we're doing here. And I'd like to thank everybody, all the hundreds of people who are doing this exercise, and the thousands that will be doing it as well. Because I feel that it does, it, it's making a difference. I would like to see it reflected on a global scale, I'd like to see if we can actually um, measure, somehow measure or um, document some sort of effect on the human collective at large. Uh, it's early days yet, <laughs> so I don't know, you know? I think I would like to see something. I would like to see some sort of um, validation for everybody to have that point of reference, yeah, so more and more people start doing the experiment around the planet, because a lot of individuals need that external validation. And our personal, I think that the majority of the individuals who are doing this experiment are having very powerful, strong, personal experiences that are going to be life-changing, I think. Uh, it'll be interesting when we follow up after we're done with the experiment. I'd like to do a follow up in a few months to see how long lasting those effects were. So, looking forward to that. Yeah. Looking forward also to the rest of these days. I don't know if I'll be able to stop on day 21. <laughs> we'll see. Alright. See you soon. Bye bye.